making something beautiful gives you a sense of purpose and, and fulfillment that really no other pastime can. Whether it's card making or woodworking even, we all have inside of us the ability to make things and do things and produce things. And crafting is just about bringing that out. People love that satisfaction of making things. It's very important that you can achieve what I can achieve, and I make it easy for you to do that. I don't remember a time when I wasn't crafting. I don't know anything different but to craft. Came out of the womb crafting. It was amazing. Little origami action. Poof, Mom, I'm here. <laughs> Anna Griffin's here, and she is truly a rock star. I've been very blessed to know of her work for many years and actually know her personally for uh, several years now. And we always get so excited. In this hour, we have seven brand new launches, seven brand new items. So it's jam packed and get ready to get started. By the way, I do want to mention Samantha Brown will be here on Sunday, October 6th with her travel and travel accessories. I did not know the date, but I found it out for you. In in case you saw our little promo. But first, let's talk about this. Coming up, I have a great showstopper and it's one of our brand new items. This is the mini nativity cutting dies with the storage panel. Um, she did a nativity collection last year. This is a brand new version of it and it's completely exclusive here on HSN. It's $21.45. It literally makes what looks like stained glass pieces. How cool is that? There's one version, there's another version, here's a third version. It's beautiful. And that is our showstopper coming up in just a few. But first, as I mentioned, we're going to count it down. We have seven brand new items. So we're starting off the hour with our very first one. And this is super clever. It is the slide card making kit. So little slider cards. And here's Miss Anna. Hi, honey. Hi. How are you? I'm good. Let's see this little magic. This is, this is our holiday home slider card making kit, meaning that in January we had our very first slider card kit that debuted. We made it so super simple to make a card that doesn't open like a book. It actually opens by sliding the message <laughs> forward. And then the card stands up. And I knew in January, when the first one came out that the Christmas one would be something that I really treasured because when you walk into my house in, at the holidays, you're greeted by this beautiful antiques jardinier in my front hallway and it's always, like right now it has orchids in it, but it, at Christmas it's full of paper whites and cool. amaryllis and the beautiful bulbs and things that we force at, the, at Christmas. We've made a card kit that you actually build this little flower arrangement and then send it on its way to your friends and family. Okay, that is so beautiful. <laughs> and it's so unexpected. It's, wow. It's just uh, so much of what we've done for Christmas this year. It's very sophisticated. And the it's going to come in the little folio box so it doesn't come in the storage box because I want you to make all of these cards and send them. You're going to make 20 cards. And so if I can show you everything that is on the table here, this is the important part where the card is actually already the adhesive is already applied on three sides and the slider is already die cut and all you do is fold it and you assemble it by putting the tag that is all color coordinated on the inside you just you, you don't need anything but we do include foam adhesive for you to put this together if you want to do that as well these are all the antique cash pose and they've all been decorated for Christmas and you see how they are um, they're replicas of antiques of porcelain That's and it, then this is all of the beautiful antique botanicals they're hand colored engravings and um, things that have been reproduced from the Curtis Encyclopedia of Botanicals from 1810. Oh neat! Isn't that oh, fun? Something I personally own. So uh, let's just uh, I actually bought it this time last year at, at an auction as, oh, you as did? a Christmas present to myself. The book? <laughs> The, the, yeah, the encyclopedia, the 22 volumes. Is it it's really? amazing. Okay, so <laughs> let's just let's just start with the card surface. So if you're working with this, you want to go ahead and bend all of these pieces um, just so that you make the slider without really doing anything. Open the card, okay? And this is going to this is this is going to go here, right? So you peel off the adhesive on the three sides, and this is where where it's really we've engineered it in such a simple way for you to be able to get this right. You're just gonna fold it over, all right? 
and seal the sides and then we're going to seal the bottom and now this is going to slide <laughs> all right great. so this now gets decorated with the little pot of your choice and the foam adhesive and the little um, collage of beautiful florals and some gold foil embellishments we even have these wonderful little sentiments that you can stick in you know just to say happy holidays these can be it's really really a beautiful um, experience of card making so easy well you know what easy, I like too is thank you gave us enough room open it up to put a little say you know, love you xoxo a little saying in there that's so lovely and i would recommend filling this out before you assemble the card okay um so that you know you and, and we actually have made it so easy for you to match these two things they actually make a sentence so merry christmas to you sending joy and happiness and then these are the oh. little joyeux noel and whatever you however you want to wish someone happy holidays uh it's all right here so love as you're working with these uh, I, I think it's it's really fun to think of the things that are in your craft cabinet like little scraps of ribbon that might coordinate with <laughs> this uh, see I'll just keep pulling them. that's so cool isn't that pretty <laughs> so really it, you know whatever you can match your holiday decor and your Christmas cards <laughs> by look at that amaryllis now that's what's so fun is that there are hundreds of embellishments in this set so if you want to fill these little pots like like we have I, I really enjoy the fact that all of the different colors of amaryllis in the same pot look gorgeous together so it's really up to you and the collage that you that you want to make and they slide it just slides right up and it goes right down okay so before we go on now imagine if you wanted to keep making this over and over and over again to your heart's desire it could be birthday balloons it could be butterflies <laughs> it could be a guy card whatever you want to do we actually have the die set to go back to this so we're not going to have a full presentation on it but this is called the slider die cut set and if you want to be able to make any version there's 280 available but it allows you very quickly to be able to replicate this kit over and over but it's in any theme and I love this too you can see there we've got beautiful florals here we've got brighter spring colors so that's available although wildly limited because you know what Anna I think is once you do this with this kit you're going to just absolutely crave to do it over and over and over again. That's why we always make the, com the companion die sets uh, to keep the card making kits on keep on making, right? right? And one of the things that I'll, I'll show you sort of the back of the collage where we've just layered from the back forward and added the foam adhesive at the bottom of the little pot so that we uh, allow the, the arrangement to move and feel more lifelike. So it's just a little tip. In, in, in decorating these, I like to over over embellish versus under embellishment, and we've given you more than you could ever hope to, to use in this one set. <laughs> just these How many cards can we make in this? 20. 20. And then you have lots of leftover beautiful things. Okay, guys, and this is brand new. It's the first look at you guys, the first chance in getting it. Just to give you a little heads up, I will warn you, when Anna's here with all the brand new items, they just go super, super quick. Uh, as a matter of fact, I'm gonna give you an update on the, on the die set in just a second, because this is gonna to be your first and last and only look at it and that's right now because we started out with how many Aaron we start out with 2800 and because you are all very clever we have 270 left so here it is if you want to keep making these slider cards in any version certainly you can use all of Anna's beautiful embellishment and papers but imagine if you wanted to use just different colors a guy version if you want to do happy birthday it doesn't matter you get all the embellishments you see here you get all the different cutouts and pieces with the instructions on how to keep making slider cards till your heart's content. This is your last chance to be able to get the dies. And again, we've got the Empress coming up. This will work with basically any die cutting system you have at home, but we do have the Empress back in stock, which is Anna's electronic embossing and die machine. So grab those before they're sold out. That is going to be almost, they're going to sell out in this hour. There's no doubt because there's hardly any left. All right, Miss Anna, we have another brand new item. I was so excited about tonight's show. <laughs> So this is going to be your Christmas decoupage, and this is a cut and emboss system, correct? So, so this is our Christmas characters uh, die set, and it's like, I think, 
18 dies, uh, I'm not sure, but it's a decoupage die set, meaning that when you die cut and you create the character, um, the, their beloved Christmas character, see the nutcracker here, you're gonna die cut the base, you're gonna die cut the jacket, the boots, the, the, the hat, and it's going to be a, a layering paper doll kind of oh, experience. stop it. So, you know, there's the Mouse King and the Sugar Plum Fairy, and done in such a way that uh, oh, you, it's really, uh, it's a very lighthearted approach to Christmas. Uh, and then uh, one of the things that we included was a reindeer and uh, a little um, snowflake to round out the scenes that you would make. So really it's uh, it's gonna come, uh, it's gonna come already on the storage on the magnetic mat, uh, meaning that it's gonna come like this, it's already pre-punched to go in your die binders okay. or any three ring binder that you have. Um, it does come with an idea sheet of how we put these together to start with. But you'll see that when you have, so the little reindeer, he has a scarf and he has a little um, a little decorative element to him that you can die cut. The same thing, this is when, when you're doing the decoupage, you're just going back over the design with your different colors. And the, the ballerina even has a, a bow for her hair. So it's a lot of fun and I, you know, I think that <laughs> I like these. Oh, it's I, adorable. I like the idea of taking um, the. I like how you something. made it whimsical. Like you didn't make it a super serious look. It's, well, we had something very first. playful about that. Yeah, yeah. It was because you know a lot of what we make is 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 quite you know yes serious, but the <laughs> <laughs> serious in design, elegant, old world, all yes. that sort of stuff. Yes. Look at this jacket. So there's even you know the little uh, places for buttons if you wanted to cut it out of multiple colors of paper and go go back and, and fill in the different colors. But what we've done on the base is the, the embossing has been done with a little inking so that you can see him come to life. Uh, and this is all about, here Here he is again, it's all about how you put those papers together. That is, I fun? love this set. I think it's amazing. So we, we make all these die sets like the, that would make a scene or uh, we, we have, we have dies that do something where they'll make a slider card or or um, this whole decoupage thing is new. So we did this for birthday in July. Oh, and oh. so, of course, I wanted to come back with those treasured Christmas oh, characters. sweet. And then I love this, too, because you really went into some of your older kits, the Christmas kit we sold a couple, uh, about a month ago. And you can pull out all that stuff we've had and just layer with that using these right it all goes it all goes together and you see like it's everything has a different a different look to it it's all about maybe that little ballerina in your life that's starring in her own nutcracker presentation this this season you know you can color this to look like her right. and and then you you're going through um, you're going through the things that you just bought from us you know already in maybe August with our Christmas plaids yes. look how great he looks with all the things that we we already have. It looks fantastic. I so love as, this. You know, as, as you're choosing what, oh, wow, what am I going to make my Christmas cards from this year? Great. This set is a, a delight. It really is. For the, all of those grandmothers in the world that love to craft for Christmas, this is a set that I think is um, something that... I know, look at this! How, look how cute send. this one is. <laughs> so again, use you, you, and obviously you've utilized a lot of your other dyes, the background dyes, the beautiful lace dyes, a lot of the products that you might have for an Anna, and just use these to really finish it off. That's yeah. that reindeer. I just I want the He's reindeer so, so bad. <laughs> yeah. So and, and you know you can make you can make all of them if you wanted to. So so as you're um, as you're layering, I'm gonna layer the little ballerina. So so it, of course she goes on top of a starburst, right? And then. And once you, once you start experimenting with the layering parts of the dies, if you do um, them out of pattern paper, you end up with a, a whole different sort of texture, which I think is really pretty. And then the little, her, they look like sunglasses, but the little bow looks like <laughs> it goes right over the top and you just add a little sentiment. And, and you've got the entire character, right? Just built from the That's ground really up. Cute. I can see using that ballerina for like uh, birthday cards too, or yeah. invitations, birthday yeah. invitations, have a little ballerina party. Right. 
right, right. It's a lot of fun. So I have lots of projects I can show you that we've made with these because uh, it was an exercise in restraint to, <laughs> to not make a, an entire table full of, of all of these wonderful little characters. So cute. All right, so here's the scoop. This is another brand new kit, $29.95. You get 15 of the dies in this kit. And you also get the magnetic sheet. Um, and this, you get an idea sheet to go with it to help you out on that. If you do not have a die cutting machine, ask about the Empress. We have it back in stock. It's also on sale. Read the reviews. It's a customer pick. But I only have about 300 of your Empress in. So you don't have a lot of those in stock, to yeah. be honest with you. It has a new configuration with the black magnetic mat. Oh, nice. Yeah. Very nice. So we'll show you that. Uh, we're going to throw up on the screen for you. And that is an embossing die cutting electric machine. If you go online, please read the reviews. People rave about that machine. You guys love that machine. And it is beautifully made. It's a gorgeous machine. Yeah. So we're going to wrap up on this one, guys. All right. I got to show you this cute little plaid cardstock because the problem is it's almost gone. So we're giving you a quick little look at it. 72 pieces. Almost 3,000 have been ordered already. You're choosing the fall collection of the holiday. What do you love best about them? <laughs> well, they all have fancy foil and they are the most popular um, plaid patterns, meaning it's everything from Tattersall to Glen Plaid. And, and so the Christmas version is bright and festive and the, the fall version is perfect for right now. I love it. Look how pretty that is. And there are two different sizes in there too? Yeah, five by seven and 12 by 12. Perfect, there you go. So that's 72 pieces. Again, almost gone. So you probably wanna order that one pretty early. Coming up, this is another brand new item. We got a lot. This is the wreath cut and emboss set. It actually makes uh, two different sizes of wreaths for you. And this is gonna be coming up. It's a five piece set for $24.95. It's another brand new piece. And you got all these cute little wreaths. I love that layering piece there in the below. And the bows are adorable yeah. on that. You gotta have a bow. If it is an Anna Griffin kit, there's going to be a bow somewhere. <laughs> all right, now we're gonna go to something that I know you love. This is something that you treasure, actually, is these yeah. iconic, very vintage Santas and yeah. looks. Yeah, yeah. I, uh, I've been collecting antique ephemera along with textiles and paintings for my whole career. And I've, I've been a designer for, for 29 years, professional designer. Um, and what's so fun is I have brought 120 mini Santa stickers and sentiments to you. That's for each of 30 designs. And oh. what's so fun is that we've made Santa um, dimensional. He's a sticker. He's got multiple layers here. And it, he is paired with what he might say. <laughs> and he can be a little snarky. You've been so good this year. You deserve all the presents. <laughs> so that's not quite snarky, but he isn't that fun that he's that's actually talking yes. and then the little sticker works. So we're, we're helping you design the front of the cards with some really fun, fun sayings. And so there are traditional ones like Merry Christmas. Uh, and that's what, you know, th th this is part of the sentiments, but we have some really funny sayings as well. Um, I think there's some that, that even, like, was this one? Jingle all the way, especially Christmas Day. So we're just rhyming. But there are there's some funny ones. Let's see. Merry Christmas to the nicest on my list. <laughs> Slay all day. Okay, <laughs> so that's where you're getting, you know, it just gets a little more fun. And they are mini, so they're half the size. I mean, he's kind of large, but they're half the size of our normal stickers. Okay, got so it. So that's fun, right? Super Comes a cute. little folio. You know Santa's all over this thing. Um, and there's some, there's some more of those. So many gifts, so little time. <laughs> You're on my nice list. Just be naughty and save me the trip. <laughs> <laughs> now there's a snarky Santa for you. And now there's 120 total in this kit and there are already stickers. So she makes it, you say, I love it because Anna makes it really easy. I You're do. doing a project, you slap it on, you're good to go. Like it's not difficult at all. And I love it too because with this one, it's more traditional colors. And so it's really easy to, uh, to build these when you're making them. Yeah, it's a lot of, they're a lot of fun. And so it, no matter what card base you want to start with, like these will make great tags for your presents this year. Uh, and, and so like I've just started oh, with, I have a lot of leftovers now, uh, you know, in from kits and things. And you'll notice that he, we have designed the stickers um, not as, you know, not as exactly as found. We've made them into shapes that I think work well for card making that, that become, this is the this is the one, Merry Christmas, the nicest on my list. Uh, it, it's 
It's the kind of sticker that you can just add to everything that I have today. Like oh, we tags have, would be cute. Right. Yeah. Well, we have like all these Christmas papers coming up. Mm -hmm. We have damask papers and we have twill papers. Maybe you have the vintage Christmas card making kit. So you see how it all, there's the plaid that you were just showing. Right. That's great. And that so, was in the 72 piece kit, right? Correct? Yeah. Okay, yeah. guys, they're already 800, almost 900 now have been ordered. How many do I have left, Erin, for the day? Okay, oh, we're good here. Um, now, we've got a little over 2,000 remaining, although, as you can see, 800 have been ordered. So this is one of those that I know it's a big day, and Anna's going to be here with several different shows. But I always say, when you get this much brand new items this early in the day, it's super smart to order it as soon as you love it and see it. And many of you collect her vintage pieces. I mean, this mm -hmm. is very classic for you. Is this the first time you've ever done an entire Sanic vintage piece? It though? is, because we have so many, um, we have so many really great fans, and they say, Send in these requests for things and this came flooding in at the end of last season where <laughs> I want all the Santas and could you please make vintage Santas well here you go because we even have vintage Santa with oh, the little cute. girl uh, I, I think this is it's a this is a classic thing that you're going to craft with you're going to use these uh, you know I, I like to spread everything out in one place on one big table before I start crafting and under and like I pick and choose you know from them kind of like the nut bowl you know when you're picking <laughs> out the cashews right <laughs> you're going for them. or you're the really chocolates different. and you want the best chocolate yeah um, it's yeah. Uh, I just did recently we shot my latest um, HSN Gets Crafty episode yeah. and it should be coming up I don't know if it's today or tomorrow or this week, but I, I literally pulled out your big Christmas card kit we did and mm -hmm. did that. I kind of walk you guys through how to, because we move very quickly on the show, so I sort of break down how to build a fancy Anna card. So you see these cards, you go, oh, I can never do that. Well, actually, you can. So if you haven't seen my HSN Gets Crafty, you can see it. If you go to Facebook and just search HSN Gets Crafty, you're going to see all the ones I've recorded so far, and my newest one coming up will be um, yours. Oh, good. Yeah, I, I loved playing with that watch. kit. I had a ball with it yeah, yeah. You it's see, sort of, there are lots of elements even here in these cards I'm showing you that you probably use from that kit yes, yeah yes. so if you already have the Christmas card kit she's already done or anything coming up today if you have, I have stuff from last year's Christmas kits this <laughs> is all going to blend back and work with it and you know what I like it's a fun way to use those leftovers but give it that extra little something new to yeah, it yeah yeah well and there are so many Santa collectors in the world uh I, I know that people you know collect Santa mugs and Santa ephemera and and to hear to have it all in one wonderful three-dimensional sticker set um, when I saw you last Suzanne we had this amazing die set called the snow globe dies and look at how Santa looks great in inside the snow globe so oh, it's all that. about um, combining these stickers with the things that you you already have yeah and and Santa comes to life he's he's ready he's ready to make a visit to your house it's so cute <laughs> almost a thousand now ordered guys so hanging right in there remember it's 120 stickers. They are indeed stickers and they're three dimensional. So these aren't just flat, boring, snoozy snicker stickers. These guys are all snickers. Snoozy snickers. I'm hungry. I'm thinking of a sticker. <laughs> $24.95. Of course, we have four flex. Got to remind you uh, two things. One, we're going to talk about the Empress, then I'm going to do their $5 shipping deal because it's a good hour to take advantage of it. The Empress, this is just a phenomenal, phenomenal die cutting and embossing system. It's electronic and it's just super powerful and it looks great. It's just so pretty. It's a huge customer pick. So if you're trying to decide, hey, you know, I need an electronic system, but I don't know which one to get, this is the perfect choice. Read those reviews. What do you love best about this version that you brought us? Well, it's our very first electronic machine because forever we've been doing the cuddle bug, which was manual. And it's whisper quiet, amazingly powerful. And, you know, the quality of the plate system is second to none. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, and it's, it's just a great system. Unfortunately, I only have about 300 left, so that's pretty darn limited. We have five flex, a nice little price on there too, and you get all the goodies you need. And you're gonna use that with almost everything you've seen in the show. Any dyes or embossing folders you see from Anna, you're gonna use it including you'll use that on the next kit. I did want to mention the $5 deal. So here's what's happening. For the next 23 hours, 22 and a half, um, you will only spend one $5 bill to ship your entire collection today, all your crafting goodies. So certainly take advantage of it. You can shop now, to, you know, it's three in the afternoon, 9 p.m. tonight, and you will only spend one $5 bill. And it's one of our last big 24-hour event days, so take advantage of it. 
important. <laughs> also, we have three or more, I think it's three or more, it's four or more or three or more flex. Four or more flex on everything today as well. We normally do not add that to a $5 shipping deal. All right, so here we go. We actually featured this a little earlier as my showstopper gave you a sneak preview. You've taken a nativity <laughs> and really done something cool and different with it. Well, I'm always, uh, you know, in, in designing new products, it's really important to up your game. You know, it's like you can't just do more of the same. So yes, last year we did our very first nativity die set and this is our mini nativity die set uh, that is designed to do two different things. Uh, the, the die can cut completely out of, of a piece of cardstock and act like a window or, or be cut and layered to be an embellishment. Oh. So there are three different scenes of the nativity and so one in a traditional window uh, sort of shape and one in uh, stained glass. Mm. So what's so pretty about each one is that you can take them and go back and uh, you wow. know, inlay like that stained glass. You can create the entire um, card face with the little nativity. They cut and emboss and you can cut them all in, and emboss them in all in one single pass. Oh, and so it's an easy, really beautiful, tasteful way to um, send a card like this. It does come on the magnetic mat, so it's red. It's already stored properly for you. Um, you just slip it into your die binder and there's an idea sheet. So um, everybody that wants those, that's really important to know. Well, and I love, she's about to show you glitter. I mean, think of all the cardstock, all the colors, all the foils, all the glitter paper you have. Well, right, and so when you start, I, th I think it's important that these cards be really tasteful. And so cutting it out of the, like a, a, a pretty sort of shimmery glitter paper gives you that, that, that lovely look. And you know, it doesn't need a whole lot of embellishment you you really can just add the smallest of things um, this you know you could even go back and use this star which is in the original nativity set um, that we still have a few left of on your website from last year's right yeah so this is so one also want to show you where if you went back and did the inlay of that same die how you would get that stained glass look you know just by cutting this out of four different colors of cardstock and saving all the pieces. Oh, and you're just kind of sticking them behind it. Yeah, and I'll show you how That's to do that, which amazing. is really, you know, this is this is a very simple um, a simple look at it, but uh, once you, yeah, let's move this. Once you cut the, you'll, you'll die cut the, the, the window, right? And if you cut it out of two different colors of paper, so you see how here we have cut it out of navy blue, and the gold and we saved the negative pieces and we put it on on a piece of tape huh isn't that something that's brilliant so then you, all you do is i'm gonna i'm doing it backwards but upside down and backwards you can just lay it in all on that one piece of tape so that everything stays in place when that you add it to cool. the front of your card. Wow. So a little piece of like shipping tape. <laughs> no kidding. Packing tape. That is so cool. And if you make it all nice and straight, it'll look great. And I'll just do that. Just take the moment and do that. There we go. So it's going, it easily goes well, right on the front of the card. Well, let me ask you this question. Wouldn't it been easier just to put a square piece of blue behind that? Because it would have been hidden. Oh, well, it would, but if you look really closely, do you see how it's all in relief? So Good with that, point. With that <laughs> second... <laughs> I knew there was a reason. I kept thinking, I could just slap a piece of blue paper so, behind there. You're cute. She's like, dear, yeah. no, 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 no. Well, no, I think it's, I think, like, for me, it's, it's about those really beautiful details. Yeah, like, I know. Like crafting that, I knew is, there was a reason. I never, well, and this one, for example, I thought was really cool because that's where you really show off when you can add the extra yeah. colors to it. Yeah. Isn't that neat? It's so, just beautiful. So uh, as you're working with these, you're um, using, oh, say, you know, use your metallics, use your beautiful matte foil, uh, and then go back and just put those finishing touches on this, like with the little bits of holly and leftover over cards it you know then it, you, <laughs> you can go all the way back to our faithful die cut set and create with these and you have you have a, a, a beautiful scene now before we go on I want to 
gonna switch to this really quickly because I know we don't have a lot of these left. Um, we all, this is the 10 piece set, correct? So we have the 10 mm -hmm. piece set, it's the Nativity Cut and Emboss set. There's a second set, What? What? there's only 660 remaining. We started out with 4,000. Oh my gosh, that's almost gone too. So here we go guys, this one is certainly a lot larger. It is, well so, so we're working with Mini tonight, but you'll see that the entire Nativity wow. um, is in, uh, you, you can cut in oh one piece. My, that's um, so that's that's done with this die, oh and uh, it cuts and embosses. And then I, I love the little miniature um, oh, scene of the the manger and <laughs> right and, and the wise men totally and the camel. Oh, that's gorgeous. And, and then there's a, an extra large die with a frame that um, is. Uh, that's a, that's a big, that's a whole card front. So that's why we wow. have the little mini ones tonight because it was time to, you know, make it a little smaller, make it a little um, a little more tasteful. Oh, um, it's beautiful though. Yeah, yeah. And this is gonna show you a whole bunch more of these. That actually you had last year. So this is the original Nativity. Yes. Right, got it, okay, right. very good. And many people asked, was that coming back? And so that, there it is, but. Not it, many. <laughs> the, <laughs> so, so one of the things about die cutting, especially with our, um, our artwork, we're, we're drawing these things from, you know, from the hand of many of the people that work uh, with me every day. And then we're, we're, we're very concerned with putting like our reticulated border dies with this. So you're looking at using the things that you already own and how they work together with something brand new. So you're not having to choose everything at once. You're choosing one special die set to make a whole new life for things that you already, already have. Own, right. Yes. And you know what I love about all three of your nativity scenes? They're very different. Yes. Like they don't have the same flavor or look to them. I well, love that. And so that we, we do that as a subject. So our, we have die sets that are decoupage, die sets that do things, and then we have them that create the entire subject. So yeah. so that's why you get three different looks in one idea. Yeah. Actually uh, six different looks if you really think yeah, about it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, because you can cut, you can easily cut out the window with by die cutting, you know, just uh, face down into the cardstock, and then it, you're left with just that negative space or cut the shadow layer and the the window at the same time. All right, so we're going to wrap up on this one. 24 or 2145 for Flex Pays, brand new. Again, popular, surprise, surprise. It just really is. It just makes great, great designs. And I know how much you guys love Anna's work. All right, so I'm going to talk about the 10 piece one last time. We started out with 4,000. We have 500 left. So already 100 were gone just from the quick little mention. Again, these are super sized. So if this is the size of the kit we just got done, this is the size of the kit you're looking at here. 30. $39.95. I have them all die cut oh, for you. Thank you, you my love. Sheet. There it is. Um, and this was last year's set, right? Yeah, yeah. Always relevant. Uh, remember, no one, not, not only one person saw your card last year, not everyone. So you have lots of options in the things that you can make and doing it in such a way that, yeah, it's all about your paper combinations and your colors and your Look embellishments. At Look at, I'll show you this one too. This is beautiful. Sorry I didn't bring you more. That's okay. Look at that. Look up. And this is it. So when these are sold out, that's going to be it for this collection. And, you know, perfect timing. I love we're doing this show on the first day of October because it gives us all the time to make these beautiful cards. And I think when you do a handmade card, I always say when you give something that's um, made by the hand, it's given from the heart. And it may, it's a lot more special, a lot more different than it is just throwing somebody a four dollar card that you bought at the store so this is your chance to get them all right just want to mention this too if you want to create some of those really really beautiful borders we've got uh, a set of two border dies we are down to the final 350 of the border dies and they are gorgeous they just add that extra wow and that extra texture and that extra layer and they do it beautifully why what makes these um, extra special though well there are radial dies so they'll take a bite out of the card and just leave that beautiful edge or you can cut with the shadow layer and cut the border out completely oh cool all right it's a snowflake and a holly design love that that's really, really pretty yeah. and again we're down to the last 300 of that 
do not forget. Big deal. We only do it on our 24 hour crafting days. Um, and I know on .com we'll have it for like the next two days. Uh, $5 to ship your entire crafting order. So you just want to get it all in in one day because that's a lot of savings on the shipping. Can you imagine if you ordered like 20 great things, which a lot of us will do today, and it's only <laughs> five bucks to ship it all. It's a big savings. Okay, we're now moving on. Miss Annie, you ready? This is your metallic card stock, right? So this is where it all started with our specialty paper range. Uh, we we were doing shimmer papers, you know, the, the, they had a luster to them. So if you want to look at this up close, you'll see that this is, see, it has that beautiful sheen. And pretty. this is, uh, this is a hundred sheets, right? Where you're getting um, 12 colors. So we're, we start with fall, the fall colors. And then we have beautiful Christmas blue and silver, then the gold. And th this is the five by seven version. So we have Christmas green. Two different reds and two different greens just for Christmas, all with that luster. And uh, do you Gorgeous. know how many sheets that is? 120. Okay, 120, not that's 100. That's a ton. <laughs> so that sort of thing is just begging to be embossed and 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 die cut. Wow. And depending on you know how you want to work with these, that's all there is to it. This is a bumper pack of of cardstock mm -hmm. that is 300 GSM, so it's nice and rigid, and it's going to make some really beautiful cards. Now, I also have it pre-cut for you in um, five by 12 or five by 10, right? Uh, a five and a half by 12. Okay. And good. there's 50 of these. <laughs> uh, uh, all right, good. I'm glad You're you close. got a card. <laughs> yes, it's long. How's that? It's long paper. It's a long rectangle. It's nice. Right. <laughs> It's, and it's all, it's cut for you because um, we were doing a lot of larger folders for Christmas. Uh, and if you wow. love to make gate fold cards, like an A2 size card, this is going to fold into that um, very easily. Oh, perfect. So again, those same Christmas colors in the red the, and the silver and the gold. And, and then there's a, a, a pretty uh, white. That's sort of an ice Ooh, that's white. that's gorgeous. Wow. Yeah. And why is it important to have really good quality cardstock. Well, <laughs> you can tell when it's bad. You know, like you get, you open the card and you're, 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 uh, oh, this feels flimsy. I think when you're working by hand and you're doing, you're spending all your time to make someone something, you want it to be a quality material to start with. And it's important that, I mean, I, I'm putting my name on it. It's going to have to be good. Well, the problem, too, is if you're doing a lot of embossing folders, the folders, if you don't have the right cardstock, literally, it'll tear through the paper. Yeah. Like, you want a really heavy duty to, to really handle that embossing of... Uh, imprint right yeah yeah and one of the things that i also wanted especially around christmas crafting is that you need multiple sheets of the paper because we're we're always making multiples of the cards once you get a design you love you can make you know you can make more than one of them true yeah and the luster is perfect for decorating at the holidays and it's going to give you that just that little bit of sheen right. now it's not Flashy it's not and trashy. And yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, she does not do flashy. If you did a flashy and trashy, one day you should surprise us all and just do a flashy and trashy set. Okay. That would be like, I, that would sell out in like two there's seconds. There's a promise. Um, <laughs> <laughs> we have a, a, a new jacket dye coming up later today that is all these um, presents that you can't <gasps> see them because oh. I'm going to, I'm going to, I'll make you see them with these metallic papers. When you go back yes. over with the, the dyes, you, you get get to um, highlight oh, and what's Isn't that, that called fun? so they can order it now <laughs> it's a it's a jacket uh, die so it's an extra large die that that cuts the whole card at once oh you're kidding and it cuts out the face of it yeah and then cuts you the whole yeah and then it cuts the bows has all the embellishments where oh you can my go back gosh, and they're called jacket add, jacket yeah. dies. they're coming up a little later but that 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 sheen gives you the metallic gives you just that extra little something that you want with it's like a Christmas glow cards. it's like a pearlized glow yeah beautiful all right in the five by seven you have 120 sheets it's just great and then if you're going to get the 12 by five and a half you get 50 sheets of that so stay right there for those again those are brand new today. All right, I want to mention the plaids too. These all have foil, whether you pick the plaid in the holiday version or what was the other version we have? The fall version, there we go. Now, how many do I have left, Erin? Oh, I only have 250 of each, so those are almost gone. I think we sold, what, three, 4,000, something like that. Oh, 2,500, wow, that's a lot. 39.95, four flex, you get under $10. You're getting 72 pieces, those are 
five by, oh, were they in a 12 by 12 and? Five by seven. Five by sevens, there we go. <laughs> so, so you see, you knew that one, I knew the other one. All right, we've got still more coming up, including a really cute ornament from St. Jude's to stay with us. Tis the season to be a VIP. Apply for the HSN card and instantly get $20 off when you're approved. As an HSN card VIP, you'll get the best deals on holiday shopping. Enjoy extra flex on beauty, fashion, and jewelry gifts all the time. And 12-month VIP financing on electronics, toys, and home items, $3.99 and up. Plus exclusive VIP offers. And there's no annual fee. Apply now. Call 1-800-695-1418 or visit hsn.com slash HSN card. Don't miss a thing with our HSN app. Get $10 off your first in-app purchase with code WELCOME10. Opt in to push notifications for early access to exclusive app-only deals. Available on Apple and Android devices. controls are the same? Think again. Now when you're watching HSN and you see something you want, you can use your remote control to order it. It's fast, it's easy, and it's a safe way to order. With HSN, shop by remote. The appraised values you see at HSN are set by independent, professionally certified appraisers. They determine, as closely as possible, the approximate retail cost of replacing or recreating the item, not the possible sell or purchase price. Because subjective estimates and judgments are involved, appraisals may vary by as much as 25%. Call your customer service rep for more information. tuned in what's happening we have a 24-hour crafting event five dollars to ship your entire order today and it doesn't matter when you shop it could be now it could be later it could be the evening time you will only spend one five dollar bill to get it home plus we have four or more flex on everything and it's the perfect time to get ready for the holidays and we're doing that with of course miss anna griffin she's here tonight we've got a fun fun show another brand new item i'm very excited about this and it's all about wreaths it is now so i've been a stationer for a very long time, 25 years this year. And that means that I make cards that are sold in stores that are sold all over the world and they're finished cards, different than this make it yourself stuff. Uh, and what's important to know about that is that a wreath, a card with a wreath is the number one card selling theme in this world of stationery. Is it really? It is. How Ask funny. any buyer for any of the major retailers, okay? <laughs> no so, so one of the things that dawned on me was like, well, wow, I haven't done a big wreath set ever, especially for dyes. And this is, uh, it, this is so pretty because you're getting the a five by seven wreath with a bow and that, that makes, you know, a really beautiful card front. And then you're getting the perfect circular wreath with a background, meaning that, it, so if you like to make square cards, I made it all symmetrical for you. So that you had everything you needed. So th this is how it's going to come. It's coming on the magnetic mat and it's already stored for you. And this is, I think, something that we've spent a lot of time and um, effort on making this a, a great out-of-the-box experience because when you have to peel them off the sheets and you, you risk bending them, and no more of that. Oh, um, so, and it's stored, it's stored on its way in. <laughs> and you get an idea sheet with this. You're going to be able to create the, the bow and its um, overlay. If you wanted to add a different color, you, you can make it dimensional. And then this little wreath is the pretty one. It's very, very delicate. You'll notice that you could even cut out the middle of it if you wanted. It's all made out of holly. And then the square that goes behind it just makes it just that much more Ooh, dimensional. So, so pretty. And as you're working with these, it's, you, you'll, you, I, I think, you know, you wanna use your die cutting machine, your impress machine. 
use any of the things that we already have given you um, in like the, the concentric dyes. Uh, like this, I'm gonna use some, this is, this is cardstock from last year's is it cardstock really? set. Yeah. It's beautiful. So you cut and emboss the wreath, and what you what you end up oh, with wow. is this. And <laughs> that is beautiful. What you'll notice about it is that it's a little more oval than it is circular, and that's because when it's straight up and down, the bow is supposed to be off center. Right. And so you can cut it out of um, your extra red color, right? And you know, maybe maybe it needs a little a little bird. Who oh knows? Gosh, this is so all pretty. about the things you know that you have you have left. You know that be pretty that, to use our Santa collection. Absolutely. You know the, all the little Santas we had earlier. That would be great. Yeah, yeah, it really would. And so you're, as you're as you're building these, if you like to make um, square cards for Christmas, or you want to, mm -hmm. you know, it, there's it's these are extra postage. Don't want to, you know mislead anybody but when you're starting with such a pretty like doily like shape mm -hmm. and then going back and adding that wreath and then you have um you have everything you need that's really pretty Isn't and, it? and i like i love your dies in this instance and the other ones too with the nativity that actually cut and they're going to give you the embossed effect at the same time yes so you, like if you see the ribbon it's hard to see but when you see, see that that's actually raised so when you touch it you literally feel that it's embossed yeah right and and, if, and on our impress you can do that um just by cutting uh, with everything face down into the cardstock and it'll emboss it in that single pass oh that's no great. more double passing um <laughs> <laughs> which Yay. is really easy and, and and it's anyway so as you're making composition i would encourage you to um, combine different papers go back and color in some holly berries because that embossed relief it gives you a place to do that right okay by the way over a thousand of these have now been ordered we have four flex so you can get these home for six dollars and 24 cents i just want to explain it really briefly in case you're brand new to us flex is easy you have four months to pay it off use any made your credit card or PayPal and you get it in you'll get it right away but it's paid off in four months and we have four or more flex on everything today and don't forget the five dollar shipping deal because it's just a fun day to just get all these really cool creative fun things build your holiday cards build your holiday presents your decor your tags with all of these can you imagine how pretty that would be to make tags out of this yeah and, and put them right smack on your Christmas right. presents or right or beautiful or on your Christmas table that could be the most beautiful put the napkin right through that um Gosh, that'd be start gorgeous. decorating yeah. early as card makers we start pretty early on the christmas cards as yeah. it's really starts in about in the summertime <laughs> um because so many of us make 50 100 ca cards and once you've got your theme you know just wow. have at it just keep that's going so pretty I, <laughs> that's amazing isn't that pretty this oh. is coming up a little later in our twall embellishment set oh, so it's all about you know using the thing over and over because they mix they match you never know what year any of these things came from and if you love to scrapbook um, we wow. definitely like to use our cut and emboss dies for scrapbooking and use it in a big way that is beautiful all right wrap this one up guys now over a thousand ordered 24.95 for flex available and again you get the entire sheet so everything is here with the magnetic sheet so it's nice and organized isn't that pretty by the way I didn't show the other side always Anna that should be a line. It should be called Always Anna. I just, you know, that would be awesome. It just, everything's done so beautifully. All right, well, something that's a must-have, especially if you're going to do any kind of crafting. Oh, well, you want to, let's do the Empress first. Sorry about that. I was moving on. Anna has a beautiful die-cutting and embossing machine. It's all electronic. It's extremely powerful. It's very quiet, and it works so easily. She used to have a crank machine that I still have. I actually pull out my, pull, pulled out my um, cuddle bug the other day to use, and I still love it. When the power went out? Yeah, exactly. So, no, I just need something really quick, so I just pulled it out and grabbed it real fast. Um, but really, the beauty of this is there's no more cranking ever, and you get such exacting results, for, especially with Anna's dies and embossing systems. They're really intricate, and so you have to have a really good cutting machine to get the max look out of what you're going to be cutting or embossing, and that machine will do it for you. And um, you can use all your dies with our machine. Any die from any, any brand. Any, and you right? can use, yes, all of our dies and other machines, so. Sure. Right, yes. They're they're interchangeable. So if you have a bunch of dies, and I'll tell you what's really fun about getting that machine is the fact that 
I have a huge collection, huge collection of your dyes and your embossing room folders. And what I found is if I had to crank, I never used them very often because it was too much work. Yeah. But once you go electronic, then you tend to really pull all those things back out yeah. and just really use them because it's so much easier now. Yeah, you're a manufacturer. All right, <laughs> it's true. All right, so we have something else that is just a must have. And this is the perfect time of year, not only for gift wrapping, I've decided double-sided tape is the best gift wrapping tape ever. Oh yeah, yeah. oh yeah. <laughs> and and, and seamless edges and the yeah. whole thing. So uh, a call for really great adhesive uh, happened in, in our office where we just weren't having any luck with other brands. So we made our own adhesive. It, it, you're getting, it's a re refillable um, container. You're getting actually two of these and two refills. It's going to give you a hundred feet of permanent double-sided adhesive. Nice. And so when, when you're crafting, you're working with your Christmas cards and let's just say you're working with our Christmas card kit for your what your crafting video. Um, video, you need to add the sentiment to the inside of the card. So, um, or, and maybe you used your the, the radio card dies that we were just showing. So oh, if you pretty. slide it in, so this one goes to that one, you slide it in it, and the adhesive on the top, you're going to get your sentiment to open properly when you make the card. So it's like right now, so you've made a new Santa card with your new Santa stickers <laughs> and you that, that, that adhesive is gonna just be the easiest um, foolproof kind of experience where you're not you're not thinking. Oh, why did my card fall apart? Why did my piece? Of, why is fall what, off? Yeah, what's going on? Or maybe you know, to, tonight we have um, our amazing new Christmas card toppers that will be on um, with Adam. And so if you need to apply them because you don't want a big you know heavy dimensional card, right? Adding that double-sided adhesive is going to make it super simple and fast. And and this is the most adhesive you get in any tape running systems we offer at HSN, HSN through Frost, all brands. So you get the two and then you get two refills, so you get 100 feet. Um, here's why I like it. It just makes crafting so much faster. Oh yeah. my gosh, if you're fiddling around with glues or anything else, once you switch to a tape runner system like Anna's, it's just, you knock it out. Well, uh, and also if you're using, um, say, the, like our new botanical card toppers that are coming up later today, I'm just showing you all the new stuff right here, <laughs> Suzanne. And Get it now more on new dot stuff. Com. Um, So what you you didn't see, you can't see that adhesive on the vellum, right? You're you're about to see it, you know, over the see what happens so that oh. it, the vellum shows through. That's this is all coming up a little later. Uh, so you don't, we have stickers, but then there are a lot of die cuts included in that set. So you have to, you have to add adhesive. And if you don't want to use a lot of foam adhesive, you would just go back with this, this double-sided adhesive. I mean, it's a must have. And especially I think if you're new to crafting and you're like, and I think it can be very frustrating because you don't know what tools to get. You're not sure what to have. These are great, great, great. I mean, it's just, it's to me, you can't have enough of these. And I go through them too, because I use a lot of double-sided because it's just fast. Yeah. It just takes your projects to a whole new level because you can get them fast. You can get them done quickly. And also if you're wrapping a lot of gifts, it makes your gift wrapping look really exceptional because you don't see the tape. Well, plus I'm just, I'm happy to have it. Like it, it goes in our tool bag, mm -hmm. you know, that, that we travel with here to, to HSN. You know, you can, you can navigate the, uh, uneven terrain. And, <laughs> <laughs> you know, maybe you're, you're using big three-dimensional stickers and things on your cards. You, that this is definitely going to be something that's going to make it easy. And I know to that's embellish. part of the Christmas card kit because I did a card just like that. Yeah. And that has hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of pieces. You got to stick something onto something else. <laughs> Use right. the tape runner from Anna. It's perfect. <laughs> $16.95. That is brought back in stock while we have it available. Of course, it's perfect for the holiday season. We're doing lots of cards. Okay. Want to give you a quick reminder. Now, this is the 10 piece nativity scene. This is the super large size. We are down to the final 350. So that's it. And this is a full full-size card you're making in fact three different designs we started out with 4,000 so this is now your last chance to get it that is the big size nativity we also launched tonight the mini nativity which is a set of three dies those are still available so you have the big size which is the 10 piece set and then we have the mini size that was launched brand new a little bit earlier in the show we might be able to try to show you that later uh, all right now we're gonna bring a little floral and sunshine it's the only non-christmas thing we're showing tonight pretty much and this mm -hmm. is so cute this is sunflowers and 
hydrangeas, but this is three-dimensional. How do you best describe that? This is making a, a layered flower. It's a die set that's gonna make hydrangeas two different ways, sunflowers two different ways, by cutting and embossing in one single pass, meaning that all the petals um, in the entire bouquet is made when you cut out of one pass so that you're not having to go back and find the parts that go on the other parts, <laughs> right. right? It's all right there. <laughs> right, it's all on the one, the one piece of metal. And so they're going to work together to create dimensional um, flowers. And so you're getting foliage and the, the mop head of the hydrangea. That, that foliage actually works with the double as well. So you see how that works. And then there are two different types of sunflowers. And depending on what your garden looks like right now, you know, you, you might prefer one over the other. Uh, so as I uh, love working with these, this is all about your paper choice uh, and your color combinations and wow. being able to create uh, lifelike looking flowers. Uh, I like everything in threes, you know, odd numbers. Mm -hmm. uh, but oh, the hydrangea is awesome. Yeah, so then our slide, those, this is from our slider. That we feature. Dies. The, we had slider dies. Oh, you know what, Erin, you might want to bring those back up. We had that in the very first item in the show, the slider dies, or second item in the show. So, Suzanne, one of the things that um, this, it's important about that, cutting that one whole top of the flower, um, I'm just going to cut face down into the cardstock. And so I am using my impress machine. It's uh, super easy. And so it has this great carry handle. You don't really need um, anything but the but that uh, to get your uh, get around your craft room. And as you're um, taking this away, oh, wow. sorry, and I, I'm without a tool in one and all kinds. I'm without everything for <laughs> die cutting. So you get the idea, right? I actually can build it over here. Um, you have the. The, you'll, you cut the foliage out of your like green paper. And so what this cut just was without weeding it is this. And then we go back and ink it just a little bit so that you get those petal details, but then go back and shade it um, with a different color of cardstock so that you get, you know, you can go right back on top of the flower or you can twist it just, you know, off center ever so slightly to make it look a little more oh, dimensional. Absolutely. Isn't that pretty? Oh, I love it. So a little rubber stamping ink gets that done. Um, maybe you want to say thanks to somebody. This is a, a bright, cheery way to to create a card. Now, if you like do the, when we had the paper, the decoupage dies on, if you like building things out of different colors of paper and cardstock, you can do that and make them very lifelike okay. um, with like basil, your basil cardstock in just varying tones. Pretty. That's awesome. Oh, I love it too. And it's just happy. Yeah. Show the really advanced one right there. That's crazy great. See it again? Yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I missed it. It's so pretty. I wanted to see it again. Yeah. So, so we've taken oh, right. the, we've cut the hydrangea out of uh, patterned paper and then used the tool in one to actually sculpt it. That's so, so cool. Yeah. So and by the way, if we did the slider thing, I got to give you a quick update. It's completely sold out. So the slider kit that we featured second, the slider die cut set, I knew it was going to sell out too, um, is completely gone now just give you a little quick update on that one okay guys also too don't forget the empress is available now you're seeing it actually working for the first time in the show and it is brilliant it's a customer pick please read the reviews we've got it in stock did you say there was a new magnetic mat in here now yes the um what that is is that so in its original configuration it debuted here on hsn last october uh it came with a different magnetic mat um this the entire configuration is sorry i'm gonna slide it is the two A plates, the black magnetic mat, the metal shim, and the embossing mat. Oh, so nice. every configuration of these plates will go through the machine with different dies and embossing folders to achieve different results. Lovely. Okay, yeah. so there it is. And the Empress is available. We have five flex. And again, this is a big, it's not a pair of earrings, so shipping it for $5 and then everything else basically ships for free today is a pretty awesome time to get your electronic cutting and die cutting machine, which is beautiful. All right, so now we're going to talk about
about one last thing, and I love this. You have created an ornament as part of our St. Jude's program. I did. And we're very excited because $5 from every ornament that's sold goes directly to St. Jude's. And look at your, speaking of Empress. <laughs> well, that's so, so she is our Empress Bear, <laughs> and she has, uh, she has a train. <laughs> she has a, a Swarovski crystal her on crown. her damask gown, and she is wearing a crown, um, which is really fun. I have I have designed. Uh, I think this is my seventh bear mm -hmm. or seventh ornament for St. Jude's, and every year it is a challenge and a delight to be a part of such a great program. Yeah, and we love it too. And these are all limited editions, by the way. We don't bring in like five thousands of any of these. We bring in a couple hundred of each bear. And we will have different guests throughout the entire time towards Christmas in this month who will be featuring their bears. But you and Sar were the first two out the gate. So if you'd like to go ahead and pick it up, you can. And remember, just helping an amazing, amazing organization. So you get a little gift, and then obviously your gift keeps on giving to so many families who need St. Jude's and really rely on how amazing that program truly is. So thank you for supporting it. It's through, uh, what is it? Uh, oh, if you'd like, we're doing Habitat? No, guys, we're doing St. Jude's at this moment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Habitat you can do as well, but I think that's on hsn.com. So don't forget, it is St. Jude's. And again, if you buy a bear, $5 will go to support the St. Jude's program. And they're helping millions and millions of people worldwide or here in the United States for sure in terms of, um, you know, helping children and, every, and their families, which is so important. It's such a good organization. All right, 20 seconds. When are you officially back? At 9 a.m. Oh, well, you're getting zero sleep, so you'll see her very early on. If you'd like to see Anna's entire collection, just go to hsn.com. A lot of you already done that, which I thought was a really good idea, so you can get it early before other items sell out. Ms. Anna, thank you. Thank you. And most importantly, thank you. The fun continues. Stay with us.